This is breaking news. Saturday Night Live's Heidi Gardner thought she'd be fired for breaking character during Beavis and Butthead sketch. At the end of April, the Fall Guy star Ryan Gosling hosted Saturday Night Live and it instantly became a fan favorite of the season. In fact, the episodes earned the sketch series its highest rating in years. Gosling did many memorable sketches ranging from Papyrus 2 to a reprisal of the infamous UFO sketch with Kate McKinnon. However, one of the biggest standouts of the episode was extremely unexpected. The episode kicked off what seemed to be a sketch focusing on the debate around artificial intelligence, but it ended up showing Gosling in the crowd dressed as Beavis and Mikey Day as Butthead. The sketch was such a hit that the duo reprised the roles at the Fall Guy premiere. One of the funniest moments of the sketch was when cast member Heidi Gardner couldn't stop laughing. While breaking has always happened throughout Senel's history, Gardner admitted she was worried it would get her fired. I just had it in my head that I couldn't do it, she explained on Today with Hoba and Jenna via EO. I think you get this big job on Senel and you want to do your job at the best of your ability. I think maybe I thought I'd get fired. Gardner went on to reveal that she typically has ways to stop herself from breaking, including biting her lip or yawning. However, she just couldn't keep it together around Gosling or Day. It didn't help that Day was staring directly at her. A friend of mine was like, you know when you spike the camera? It's like, Mikey spiked you, Heidi, she recalled. He spiked me. It's like his eyes just go. He didn't look fully human to me. He looks like a kangaroo. I was trying to imagine seeing him in my head so I was prepared for it, but I just couldn't prepare for what I saw. I really try, she added in an interview with Vulture. I even saw Mikey out of the corner of my eye seconds before I went live. I saw the red shorts. I knew I couldn't look over there again. Mikey even told me later that he was bending down and hiding himself so I wouldn't see him. What is the Fall Guy about? You can read Universal's description of the Fall Guy here. He's a stuntman, and like everyone in the stunt community, he gets blown up, shot, crashed, thrown through windows, and dropped from the highest of heights, all for our entertainment. And now, fresh off an almost career-ending accident, this working-class hero has to track down a missing movie star, solve a conspiracy, and try to win back the love of his life while still doing his day job. What could possibly go right? From real-life stuntman and director David Leach, the blockbuster director of Bullet Train, Deadpool 2, Atomic Blonde, and Fast and Furious Presence, Hobbs and Shaw, and the producer of John Wick, Nobody and Violent Night, comes his most personal film yet, a new hilarious, hard-driving, all-star apex action thriller and love letter to action movies and the hard-working and underappreciated crew of people who make them, The Fall Guy.